2018, it has been two weeks since the release of that massive grand jury report in Pennsylvania that named more than 300 priests who had sexually abused more than 1,000 children. And that release of that report is one of the reasons why, for the first time since The Keepers came out on Netflix, that the woman who used to be known as Jane Doe granted an on-camera interview. Jean Hargadine Wainer was sexually abused by Father Joseph Maskell and even says that she was taken by that priest to see the body of a teacher who she had told about the abuse, Sister Catherine Sesnick. Now, in the 1990s, she sued the Archdiocese of Baltimore under that name, Jane Doe. The lawsuit was thrown out, but then last year, she resurfaced on that Netflix series, The Keepers. Now, she's calling for a grand jury investigation into the Archdiocese of Baltimore, similar to what happened in Pennsylvania. Will there be answers? Will people know the final uh, what happened, who done it? No, I don't, I don't think that will happen. But I think people will be clearer about um, who, who had their hands in it, and there will be more room to move forward. A spokesman for the Archdiocese of Baltimore tells WMAR 2 News that the Archdiocese would cooperate with any law enforcement effort to hold abusers accountable, but added that the disclosure of names and information about dozens of priests by the Archdiocese back in 2002 is something that had not happened in Pennsylvania that contributed to the push for a grand jury probe there, he says. Much more of that interview with Gene Hargan and Wainer coming up tonight on WMAR 2 News at 6 and at 11.